Hello and welcome to another training video for the Residence Trainer. In this video we're going to be taking a look at flexibility in small shank and large shank uh, trombones and baritones. Okay, we're going to be taking a look at arpeggios and how we can improve our airspeed as we're going into the upper register. Okay, so as we're playing the arpeggio, uh, we're going to go ahead and be playing uh, the arpeggio and it's going to go ahead and stay up on the first three notes and then on the top note it's going to drop which means they've done their embouchure correctly but they have an increased velocity okay in their airspeed and so this is going to very quickly be able to diagnose what's going on right there and also tongue placement are they arching the back of the tongue correctly and you can hear right there the sound got smaller the tone the tone quality of the buzz changed uh, because there was less air to support the embouchure. So if they do it correctly, deep breath. Okay, and if you notice, the volume didn't get smaller on the high note. It stayed the same, which means better tone quality. Uh, they're not going to be shoving the mouthpiece into their face to be able to do that. And they're going to be supporting the embouchure and tongue placement is going to be better. So it's going to be very easy to diagnose. Okay, uh, these will only take you up to like a concert E flat. Uh, for the upper register, but it's teaching them the skill of this is how you get up to those notes and then the other half octave, if it's required to play that, will go ahead and take care of itself because they will have learned how the embouchure has to be in tandem with their diaphragm and their air velocity. Alright, thank you very much for joining us today.